Wondering if it's normal to have insulation coming out of your vents? That's a pretty common question here at Fox Family Heating, Air, and Solar. Hey guys, if this is your first time watching us, uh, please click subscribe and maybe uh, tap that little bell right next to it. If you do, you'll be notified of all of our videos coming up. I have seen insulation or something black, yellow, pink, or white coming out of my registers in the living room or bedroom. How would an HVAC technician answer that? Ductwork in the 1960s and 70s pretty much came in the form of hard pipe, which is what most people have in their older homes. There's no lining on this. It's 24 gauge sheet metal rolled into a pipe. And this is really good stuff. It was usually put together in attics by real tradesmen with quality materials. They also did it when the sheetrock walls weren't up either. This makes the installation process much easier. But for the sake of the hard work those technicians put in, it should be mentioned that a lot of that work was not. The other type of material used was a flexible duct, like a lot of us are seeing nowadays. But this flexible ducting had a thin, felt-like lining it instead of the vinyl linings that they use today. That old lining breaks down over time. Consider the fact that it's been used for well over 30 years, which is when most ductwork is ready to be changed out anyways. Hot and cold air has been passed through it, completely dehydrating it over the years, and deteriorating it now to the point where it's flaking off and making its way to the register. These ducts are rare to come by as they've been phased out by most uh, new ductwork installations here in the Sacramento area, so I rarely even see those types of ducts anymore. The second reason is a torn duct. We just went to a call where Keith, one of our technicians, was called out to diagnose the reason why white insulation was coming out of this person's registers. At the same time, airflow in her bedroom decreased, making it warmer in the summer and colder in the winter. Keith went up to the attic where the ductwork was and found an 8-inch duct, this time with the vinyl lining, that had a large hole torn into it by a rat or other attic critter. This was allowing the insulation to get sucked into the ductwork and onto the register where it was coming out. Number three, ducts are not sealed at the plenum. Sometimes a duct will fall off a collar if it's not secured tightly to the plenum. Or maybe a repair has been done on that duct years ago. If some insulation got into that duct while that repair was being made, and it finally just made its way to the register, that could be your reason. It's possible it just now finally reached your register. A long zip tie called a panduit is usually what's strapped around a duct to secure it to the collar on the supply plenum. Using approved mastic sealant and a panduit is the only approved way of securing a duct to the supply plenum. And number four, the supply plenum could be peeling from the inside. The lining on the inside of the plenum is peeling off and literally making its way through the duct to your register. Inside the sheet metal plenum, it has to be insulated just as much as the ductwork is, so you don't lose or gain any heat during the delivery process. That lining is usually black, and it peels off will find its way to the register. And this is just another sign of an aging system that may just need an upgrade on its ductwork or the entire system. If you have insulation coming out of your registers here in the Sacramento area, please give Fox Family Heating Air a solar a call and we'll come out and diagnose with see what's going on. Maybe you can get up there and check it out yourself if you're able to. All those ducts up there should be sealed and have no leaks. And sometimes you have to look really hard too because you might be on one side of the duct and the hole might be on the other side of the duct that you're looking at, like down towards the bottom. Well, thanks so much for watching this video, and I really hope we answered any questions you had about why insulation is coming out of your registers. If this is your first time watching us, uh, please click subscribe and maybe uh, tap that little bell right next to it. If you do, you'll be notified of all of our videos coming up. If there's anything we can do to help make our customers' lives any easier, that's what we're here to do. Thanks so much for watching, and we'll see you on the next video. You're watching Fox Family Heating and Air Conditioning. Don't forget to subscribe, and check out more of our videos by clicking on the right side of the screen.